Hi, and thanks for stopping by. My name's Larry Weinstein, and I'm both a CPA and the founder of SolveMyTaxProblems.com. And today, I want to answer a question that I hear quite a bit, and, and that question is, is if I owe money to the IRS, if I pay them in full, will that solve my problem? Now, the answer to that, of course, is a resounding yes. If the IRS says that you owe them X number of dollars and you pay them off, then the IRS will, be, will consider your account to be paid in full, and accordingly, no additional collection activity will occur. But, and however, before you go ahead and pay the IRS, I would uh, suggest that you look into, has a tax return ever been filed on that particular year in question? Because it might be that the IRS prepared a substitute for return. And if they prepared a substitute for return, the amount of tax they say that you owe may be too high. Now, why would that be a problem? Well, that would be a problem if you go to pay it in full and the amount that, that they say that you owe is too high, then obviously you'd be paying more money than you're legally required to pay. So I would get in that situation an account transcript and see what's happened. Has the IRS filed that return for you or did you file it by yourself? If you filed it by yourself, then likely the balances that are, are on the account are correct. They probably have some accrued interest and penalties that they've assessed onto your account, but at least the tax that was reported was based upon your doing and not the doing of the IRS. So, so to answer the question, if you owe the IRS money and you pay them in full, then the problem is solved. So if you do owe money to the IRS, always look to that solution first. Look to see if you can pay them in full. That stops all enforced collection activity. That's it for today. Look forward to talking to you again later. Thanks for stopping by.